Hey everybody, this is Debbie from Project 39. Um, I have a tip for you. I want to show you how to make swing tabs. In this doggy album, um, I made them out of dies that were shaped like the dog bone. Um, I think I got that set from Epico Park. Where there were other dies in there. Uh, dog paw, there was the heart, and of course the dog bone, which also could work for Halloween. So um, what I did is I took some heavy duty guard stock, 110 pound weight. You also could use a punch, by the way. So I punched out two, or die cut, two shapes, um, and then a third one in whatever you want the top color to be. So here we've got uh, two black stars and the turquoise one. So taking some glue, um, you'll put glue on the two layers. This one will go on top of here. And then this will go on top of there. Now, if you wanted to, you could ink around the edges. Um, but in any case, let it dry. All right. Now, what we're going to do is take Versamark ink and ink the whole stamp. And you're going to use embossing powder, which I put in here. So, Versamark ink, as yes, I know my ink is trashed. And then we're going to put it in the embossing powder and then heat emboss it. It is going to be noisy. Now at this point, if you wanted to, you could dip it in the embossing powder just to give it another coat. Um, that's entirely up to you for the video. I'm not going to do that right now. You also need to make a hole. So it's a swing tab. So you need to have a something that's going to swing around. You know, so you can't do it in the center because that is not going to help you. So I'm going to just put it on one of the points of the star, making sure there's still enough paper on the side. Um, and that is where you're going to put a brad. Put it on the paper before you glue the paper down. And I'll show you one here. That's a pretty turquoise star. Usually use an eraser just to push it down and then it will swing. So I've never used a star before but it would work. You just have to make sure there's enough clearance with the top page to the bottom. Um, obviously with the dog bone I didn't have any problems with it. That worked well. Also you could use a heart. Now this one I used um, red glitter embossing powder. That would be fabulous. Could do the star for Christmas and that. That would be great for Valentine's Day. And also this paw. So I did put the hole in the center of the paw because if you make a pocket like this, um, there we go. This one I did not emboss, which you don't have to. If you don't want to heat emboss it, you absolutely don't need to. Um, but I just like the look of it. All right. And there's a tip for you. Uh, thanks for watching.